So if you're into safety second type of automotive tricks, then this one's for you. This starter bump method will break loose the highly torqued crank pulley bolt. Before trying this, make sure you have the EFI fuses pulled so your engine can't start up. To make this trick work, you'll need a breaker bar and the appropriate socket. Attach the breaker bar and the socket to the crank pulley bolt. Note for this video, the 2JZ rotates clockwise, so you want the breaker bar resting on the ground on the left-hand side of the car. If you get this part wrong and have the bar lying on the right side, you will whip that breaker bar across your garage. I wrapped a bungee cord around the bar just in case. Once the socket is on the pulley bolt and the breaker bar is resting firmly on the ground, you can now bump the starter to crank the engine and use the torque created by the starter and the mass of the rotating assembly to break the crank pulley bolt free. One good bump of the starter should be all you need. Now you can just loosen the bolt by hand.